thing. How'd you like that whole little intro scene there, all like cinematic and such? Well, actually, I don't know if it really turned out cinematic or not because I haven't watched it yet, even though you have, because I'm still filming this from the past, back before I made the video, and you're watching it from the future after I made the video, yet here we are at the same time talking about it. So the internet is a very weird place. Uh, anyway. Uh, we got a little Ford Ranger here that we are just doing a little quick across down tow over to Elite Fleet Automotive for some transmission issues. And I know plenty of you are going to say, oh, that's a Ford Ranger, it's a manual transmission, you don't have to put it on dollies, you can just tow it from the rear, or it's a manual, so you can just put it in neutral, going two miles. Yeah, you're right, uh, you could. I could pick it up from the rear and let the front end roll, and uh, it'd be totally fine for this two miles. And I could, even since it's a manual transmission, uh, pick up the front, put it in neutral, and let the back end roll for this two miles. It's not going to hurt a thing if it was in the same condition it was when it left the Ford factory in 1997. But since it's on the back of my tow truck, I don't think that's the case. And like I said, it's transmission issues is what I was told. And since this is a fleet truck that was just sitting in a yard and is dead battery and all that, I don't know whether that transmission issue is a transmission issue, is it a transfer case issue, is it one of the diffs on either end. Uh, a fleet driver said it has transmission issues. What does that mean? I don't know. You don't know. Shop doesn't know. I can't ask the guy who owns the truck. He's probably never even sat in the thing. So we just pick it up, we put it on the dollies, and we carry it that way, that way. Nothing moves, nothing rolls, no matter where the problem is in this truck. Not our problem. The dollies take a whole grand total of two minutes to set up, so it's not like it's that big a deal. And it covers me no matter what the problem is, so that's what we do. Okay, we are here at Elite Fleet Automotive, and we're going to stick this thing right there. So we'll get the chains all off, get it all unstrapped, everything, back it in here, and drop it on the ground. got it backed into the alley here and still enough room to get the forklift out so we'll call that good enough let's go get paid and get out of here say look at that truck don't you want that she gave me a bunch of scenarios happy birthday hey! it's nate's birthday say happy birthday how old are you 12. i believe that <laughs> <laughs> This is what your employees do when they want to raise. <laughs> Pudding pop. <laughs> oh. Pudding pop. It's funny because he's fat. <laughs> <laughs> the lady laughed so hard. She's like, Pudding pop. And I was like, yeah, you wouldn't understand. <laughs> okay. Well, there was cake. So we stayed a little while and ate it. And then, uh, then got a check too. So that's also handy. So got to love getting paid with cake. And we'll hop in the truck and I think go home and try to organize the shop because I really need to do that. So let's head out of here. But first, I want to go up here, go through a roundabout, and then get fuel because our day won't be complete until we do that. Roundabout and fuel. There you go. Now the video is complete. We covered all our bases. And that's it for this one. So see you guys next time.